Now, we want to look at a story where our reporter Lofty Matambo brings us a unique story of a woman who dared uh, to go into the area mainly handled by men. And, uh, well, she, she requires to pull a hand cut across town. Let's take a look. Mimi nilifanya tu kwanza kuonyesha tu na watu. Ndio nikajua eh kumbe nimepostwa kwa Facebook na sijui. Helen Nyongesa is referring to some random pictures taken along Ronaldingala Street in Nairobi by a Kenyan who later uploaded them on Facebook. They have since gone viral with Kenyans looking for this industrious woman in order to reward her hard work. Here is she at Kaloleni Market in Nairobi. And this is how she starts her day, early morning, getting her stock ready. Yes, banana stock. <laughs> this 30-year-old lady from Bungoma County found herself in this situation after the death of her husband in a road accident in Kawangware three years ago. He left her with three children. The firstborn that she had at the age of 18 is now 11. <laughs> After the demise of her husband, Helen saw it all working in Nairobi's Gidurai estate as a housemaid. She sometimes depended on church donations. One day, she was blessed with 200 Kenya shillings. Her capital of 50 shillings opened up her financial doors unexpectedly. She graduated to selling sweet potatoes. Hiyo besheni imekuja ikazaa wilbaro. Wilbaro nimekuja nikaendelea hivyo nikiuza ngwashe na uza ngwashe na sukuma ngwashe kutoka Mudhurwa nikipeleka Nairobi University. Na sukuma ngwashe nikitoka hapa mpaka Nairobi University. Na wilbaro na mtoto kwa mgongo. Haya nikaendelea hivyo nikaendelea hivyo nikaona hiyo kazi ni mzito huko nimekuwa mbali. Nikaona ah hii wilbaro si inaweza kufanya nini? Inaweza nunua mkokoteni. She later moved to selling bananas, citing hardship, and moving around with sweet potatoes, growing her banana capital to about 15,000 Kenya shillings. Sasa ni machukua tu mandisi ya hile 4,400. Sasa hii, ni kidoko tu hii ni kama ni kukatu. Ni kama suchafanya kazi. Nona, eh, ni kama suchafanya kazi. Sasa ni naona, hata leo ni msi kuenda kazi. Lakini kama ni meuzo mzuri mbizi, hata nezo uza mandisi ya 20,000 badei. Each time she thinks of who is at the back of her cart, Helen sees nothing but a bright future, a bright one for her little ones. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a pick up. I was going to take a little bit of a is a message to her peers, both male and female. Usijakuwe kazi, chipatie moyo, na ukienda, bate ya jioni, ukienda kusleep, bless God, break God. It's a journey that Helen has embarked for over a year now, a journey of self-reliance, a journey that Helen believes is going to change her life and that of her family at large. Lofti Matambo, KTN News, Nairobi.